she yells at the other car. She says, see that? Wow. Oh, look at this one, Leilani. Wow. It's like a traveling show, so they go all over. From the reviews, <laughs> it looks like it's pretty lame, but Leilani is so little, she'll probably really enjoy it. Um, and we end up getting free tickets, so we're gonna take advantage, because we're gonna be in Orlando this weekend anyways for a wedding. We were supposed to leave the house at eight this morning, and it's now nine, and we're like, <laughs> just on our way. It was a crazy morning with the girls they were not having it so it was hard getting out of the house and just like anything with two kids it just takes forever but we're excited are you excited life with girls yeah it was a I stressful morning normally Jurassic Quest is uh I think when we looked it up it was like 55 bucks per vehicle so this year because of COVID you have to drive your vehicle around today our plan is Head to Orlando, bring the girls to see dinosaurs, and then after that, we're, uh, we got a hotel in North Orlando, and one of my uh, buddies from high school, it's his wedding, so we're gonna go do that tonight. My parents are coming over to watch the girls, so this will be the first time that we're actually ever leaving summer, right? Yeah. It's the first time. Yeah. But, um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Should be fun, though. picking up our tickets our free tickets that we got from uh, our friend Mike's dad that works over here at the Orange County Convention Center We're supposed to pick it up by will call we have no idea where will call is but we ended up already in the line for Jurassic Quest so we'll see what happens hopefully they'll just let us in all right so it worked out we got Leilani in the front seat just because we're going five miles per hour they said you're allowed to take your kid out of the car seat is Jurassic Quest. And we missed the station. You're supposed to like tune into a station to like hear what all the dinosaurs are and everything. And we missed the sign so we don't even know where to tune in. So we're just driving. Is it a dinosaur? Yeah, that is a dinosaur. But someone in the car is having a good time. Yeah. That's all that matters. And that's Leilani. Can you say hi? Wow. She yells at the other car. She says, "See that? Wow! Oh, look at this one, little body. Wow! Wow! You see the dinosaurs? Wow!" Over it. Yeah. I am too. 
a long, it's a long line. It's been like 45 minutes already. Yeah, we got here like right at 10. Look at this Look at his butt, Leilani. Look at his butt. Look at the dinosaur butt. All right, we just left Jurassic Quest. It was interesting. Um, Leilani liked it. I mean, I think she lost interest like halfway through. It's pretty long. It's almost an hour. And the yeah. cars go pretty slow, but you'll see. She liked it. Um, we're all starving. It's like 1130. We've been in the car for two and a half hours. So we're going to go to a restaurant over here. Um, what do you think of Jurassic Quest? Uh, I mean, Leilani liked it, so that's all that matters. But um, would I pay 55 bucks for it? Probably not. Uh, you know, luckily we got the tickets for free, like I said, from our friend Mike's dad. But uh, he works at the convention center. And uh, I feel like, you know, if you're going to spend 55 bucks to see dinosaurs, I would preferably spend it on food at, uh, what was that place called in Disney? T-Rex Cafe. The T-Rex Cafe. So I'd rather spend, I'd rather spend the 50 bucks on food and drinks and then, you know, you get to see dinosaurs anyways for free. It was outdoors this year because of COVID. I think if it was indoors in the right setting, it would have been cool. Okay. If it was indoors in the right setting, it would have been cool. But because it was like in a parking lot and you had to sit in your car and drive around real slow, it was. Yeah, I mean, I would say maybe, maybe if it was normal, a normal year and it wasn't COVID and it was at the convention center, inside the convention center, the setting would probably look a lot better. But it just, I don't know. It felt weird being in a parking lot, just following cars, going five miles per hour. And all the dinosaurs were pretty scattered out. So. It didn't really, I, I guess the environment and the setting, they could have done a little it bit better. It didn't have like a wow factor. It was like. Yeah. It was just like you're driving around and then you see three dinosaurs. You see, I mean, you guys saw the video, but um, but we still had a good time. I mean, if you're bored on a Saturday and have nothing to do, I would still probably recommend it. We're going to go grab some lunch and then after that, we're off to the hotel and then... Uh, my parents are gonna watch Leilani in summer, and we're gonna be going to a wedding tonight, so. Good times. We'll see uh, what other fun we can get into today. Okay, so we just checked into the hotel room. p.m. right now the wedding doesn't start until 6 p.m. so we're just gonna hang out at the hotel room for a little bit my parents should be here in the next couple hours to watch the girls and then uh, that way me and Nikki can get ready without the girls running around um, and then off we go we're gonna go see my buddy Trey get married tonight at 6 p.m. so we'll see you guys there we're about to go to this wedding we got Lolo and Lola here to watch the girls Hello. Lola with Summer. Mm -hmm. And our awesome view from the Sheraton. <laughs> Wedding time. COVID style. <laughs> 